Order. Question number 12, Madam Fox. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. To the Minister for Infrastructure, how much of the 11 billion infrastructure fund announced in Budget 2017 will go towards improving infrastructure on the East Coast? The Honourable Simon Bridges. Speaker, on behalf of the Minister of Infrastructure, this government's allocated $23 million in capital to Tairawhiti District Health and other projects to upgrade grade medical facilities in the region. Uh, further, at least $6.5 million in capital has been allocated for transport upgrades in the region, including the construction of the Panico and uh, Wallace Hill Slow Vehicle Bays and the Motu Bridge replacement. This is on top of a number of infrastructure projects which were allocated capital in previous budgets. And indeed, um, given the very large capital uh, investment coming over the next four years, there may be additional investments made in the East Coast. Supplementary question. So, order, order. Supplementary question, Madam Fox. Uh, what is he doing to support an improvement in infrastructure on the East Coast to support landowners with harvest harvestable forestry holdings who are considering burning down their trees because there is no way to move them due to poorly maintained and impassable roads? The Speaker. Honourable Simon well, On behalf of the Minister of uh, Infrastructure, um, the, the Minister of Primary Industries and the Associate Minister are probably better placed to answer that, but I'm broadly aware that we have forestation programmes uh, at work uh, at the moment uh, on the East Coast, and I also know that through our Tairawhiti Regional Economic Action Plan, there are specific measures in relation to both forestation and also in relation to processing to ensure viable uh, economy uh, and environmental measures in the area the me me member uh, speaks of. And that concludes questions for oral answer. On the 20th of June, when the House was considering